Good morning, boys. At least I think you're all boys. Your morning swim. So I had the idea of using Silas's little wagon so that Daisy, oops, got to be careful, babe, when you turn, so that Daisy wouldn't be stuck just sitting. She could actually move around. She could see the other ducks and socialize, which she seemed to really like it when she came out here. First thing she did, go this way, babe. Silas, go this way. The first thing she did was start calling to the other ducks. Silas, back up. Come this way. Go that way. Over this way. Around the pool like you were doing earlier. Go. <clears throat> Be careful. Keep going, bud. Take her back over to the other ducks. Put her next to the pool. See if she talks to him. Put her in the shade, baby. Here. Yeah. Oh, they all jumped out. Yeah, put her in the shade. There she goes. Talk to him. She misses her ducks. Yeah. Can't wait till she can run around with them and actually swim. <laughs> I see you watching me, Donald. He's the white one. We call him Donald Duck. We're not sure what these other two ones, if they're girls or boys, none of them quack except for Daisy. So that's why I'm thinking Daisy's the only girl. The other two, I think the one on the right might be a ruin duck. And the one on the left, I think is a mallard. But I'm just not sure, positively sure if they're boys or not. They're still so young, so they haven't got their adult feathers yet, so their coloring should help me tell if it's a boy or girl, but that won't happen for a while. But pretty sure that Donald, the white, the peacon one, pretty sure that is a boy. 